Welcome hey. back, everybody. With the recent massive shootings like the one at Sandy Hook Elementary and the Colorado Theater, a law enforcement agencies across the country are getting proactive. Including our very own San Juan Police Department, who has joined us here, and they've integrated a canine attack dog that they are currently trained for emergency situations. This morning, we have Sergeant Rolando Garcia with us, along with Officer Juan Cedillo and Rex. Hey, Rex. How's oh, it going? Oh, I probably shouldn't say his name too, too loud. He kind of <laughs> sparked up. No, he'll be fine until you give him the command. So. So, Sergeant Garcia, tell us a little bit more about the efforts that the Juan Police Department is trying to put forward to implement Rex into the force. One of the main reasons we purchased Rex was to add him to our regional response team, which is our alert team. Our, uh, we have a regional SWAT team um, that is serving throughout the valley. And what it is is a good example. Yesterday, we were called out by Donna PD, and Rex was part of that team as well. So, uh, anytime we have a situation where we have a barricaded subject or, or something else that you know the normal officer we don't want to introduce, we send Rex in there as a different tool, and it, it's a different option available to our guys to make sure that everybody is safe, including the the suspects. Now we hear a lot about K9 units, and, and normally they're uh, used to look for for bombs or for for drugs, but this is a little bit different. Yeah, Rex is trained uh, specifically for tracking and for attack work, which is bite work. Um, and again, he is on patrol. Uh, he is attached to our regional team, but uh, Officer Cedillo works the graveyard shift, and any time uh, we have a burglary, perhaps at night, that we're tracking a suspect, we'll be able to use Rex in that. All right, well, let's try and see what Rex can do yeah. here. I'm going to go ahead and step away from the shot. I don't want to go ahead and get injured or anything. This is Rex. Ready? Ready? Yeah. You can see. You can whip him around. He won't let go of the bite. Oh my goodness. Ready? And is there a command word or a, like the, what's the special word in case you want him to let go? Or? He is trained in German. Uh, oh and, and it's different words that, that uh, you give him. But if you heard right before he attacked, he gave the command of Stellan. And that is the, the command to attack. Um, oh if we were to approach the dog right now, He's already done his work, but if I came up to him and patted him on the, you know, he'd be fine. He wouldn't, uh, okay. he wouldn't attack us or anything. He's okay. So, but Rex is, it's, I was petting him earlier, uh, very lightly, <laughs> but he seems like a really, you know, gentle guy, a he, gentle little puppy. He is a normal dog <laughs> up until you give him the, the command to attack. And uh -huh. after that, uh, you know, he turns into a different uh, mode and, and gets to work basically. Turns and, he, and he gets a good grasp of yeah. that sleep yeah, there. You, you've seen that before. Yeah, I have. <laughs> you know, I've met Rex before and, and he has a very good grip. <laughs> you had an encounter with Rex. I would not want to encounter him without the sleeve. Absolutely. And you I know think what? that's the whole point. A little later we're going to have maybe perhaps Brad do a demonstration and see how we'll he see. does. <laughs> so for a second and a half hour, for a second hour, so stay tuned for that one. All right, Rex, be careful over there. We'll be right back with more. Stay with us.